everyone to NBA basketball here on 2K Sports. Tonight, it's Noche Enabia, a celebration of the amazing Latin culture in this league and its fans all around the globe. A great tradition we get to enjoy. I'm Kevin Harlan. With me tonight, former NBA players Richard Jefferson and Greg Anthony with David Aldridge joining us courtside. Now let's take a look at the Nuggets opening lineup. The small and power forwards are Porter and Gordon. Murray and Brown are the guards. And it's Jokic in at the center position. And for Los Angeles, at the guard positions, Russell and Reeves. Down in the block, it's LeBron and Davis. And it's Hachimura in at the three spot. And the regular season, Richard, is finally here. <laughs> I am excited to work with you again this season. Cannot wait for the schedule. Oh, to work with you, Kev, man. You're a legend. And it's always an interesting journey. We're fired up. These teams are fired up. Let the games begin. And good that time. And this speaks to Murray's determination. Even with intense defense on him inside, he gets it done. Russell against Murray. Russell passes to Reeves. Tries from 10, and he drops that one in. Guys, it's ridiculous. He's just an absolute surgeon when he has the ball. This man is surgical. There is no way to slow him down when he wants to score. Here's Brown. Six to shoot. Denver needs to get off his shot. Murray for three. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Murray. Murray's got five now. And operating off the ball, credit Murray for staying engaged, ready to fire when asked. Pass to Davis. Kicks it out to James. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. Oh, textbook pick and roll there. James doing a great job breaking down the defense. Murray scanning the floor. To the left side wing. Again, the Nuggets score. And that's how you execute offensively. Murray with a great job of getting it to his teammate. Russell kicks to James. Now about two minutes gone here in the first quarter. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start. Two for two. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. Yeah, when he gets engaged this early in the game, it's bad news for the defense. He can roll this start throughout the rest of the game. And I feel like Jokic has 360-degree vision. I mean, no matter where the open man is, he's going to find it. The Lakers have gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. Greg, no secret, this Nuggets offense revolves around the two-time MVP, Nikola Jokic. First free throw is good. Well, as long as the Lakers have a healthy Anthony Davis, RJ, they will be a factor, won't they? Davis can dominate on both ends, and it is rare to see that. Both shots good from the strike. And Greg finishing last season with the number one seed in the Western Conference. A lot of people still slept on the Denver Nuggets. And Kevin, they've had great regular seasons before, only to fall short. But with a healthy Murray and Porter Jr., Jokic finally had the health to get it done. Now here's Murray. Over Russell, and it's sent back by Russell. You knew eventually they were going to miss one. At least you hope. And the slam dunk by Russell. Yeah, multi-dimensional yeah. score. Hard to match up with Russell in that kind of space. Russell against Murray. Here's Brown. Puts up a three. Another three for Denver. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. 
Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You got to show some fire and keep defending. 13 feet away. LeBron with the block. And LeBron with the block. Nuggets block. The shooters are working hard, but he is all over them. And we're just over three and a half minutes into the first quarter. Porter kicks to Gordon. Murray against Russell. Just five on the clock. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by James. Here's Jokic. His last outing, he had 18 points. Three on the clock. Here's Murray. And a missed layup. And you don't see that every day. Usually he'll convert when he gets that close to the rim. Count it. And sensing the situation, Russell with the stop and pop. Nice choice. The pass to Jokic. Gordon up on top. And Davis sends it back. And he's able to get it back. And the basket by Gordon. For Los Angeles, they've gotten all five of their shots to go down in the first quarter. Terrific start. Pass to LeBron. Here he goes. And the dunk by LeBron. LeBron dunked that like he was angry. Is he okay? Man, he got the table shaking over here. Murray against Russell. Murray outside. And Jokic wide open. He shoots off target with his three. I'm shocked that didn't turn into three points. I mean, he makes you pay on those nearly every oh, oh, my. Nice finish. And his handle might be an underrated part of James's game. Totally throwing off the defender with that move. Nice angle on that replay with the AT&T 5G slam cam. Timeout is called. First of the game for the Nuggets. Yeah, a moment now to check out the numbers for Gordon. He had a strong showing last season. He was around 16 points a game, six rebounds, and three assists. But you look at all that, and really it doesn't give you the entire picture of his impact defensively. Just in general, numbers don't tell the whole story with defense. Guys like him, you have to watch to understand his impact. Russell against Murray. And he gets the bucket. Jamal Murray's Murray. got nine. Man, he's having quite the quarter converting at a really high percentage. Loads it up for Davis. And it's slammed in by Davis. Throw it high and watch Davis fly. Wow. Nuggets trail. Murray outside. Pass to Jokic. Here's Brown. He has five. There's three pointers off the mark. Here's Reeves. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Reeves has got his second bucket of the game to go. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. There will be some letdown at some point, but these teams, they are built to score, so. Here's Jokic, and Davis sends it back. And this is how AD led the league in block shots. It's not just his wingspan, but it's his awareness, his basketball IQ when it comes to reading the game. Here's Brown. Misses the step back jump shot. Los Angeles leading by four. Davis the pass to LeBron. And it's sent back by Jokic. And putting that reach to work. Jokic just erasing that shot attempt. Here's Reeves. That's in there. Davis with the assist. Reeves has got his third bucket of the night. Oh, this is the kind of start they were hoping for. Murray down low. He's guarded by Russell. 
And so it's Russell with it. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. It's Davis with the drop. Boy, I tell you, that's a freight train coming down the tracks right there. You don't want to mess with AD when he's on the move like that. The Nuggets trail by eight. And Richard with D'Angelo Russell. He's a guy who can do just about anything in the backcourt. That's right, Kev. If you need him to be a true floor general, he can do that in spurs. And if you need him to be a score first offensive catalyst, that's his sweet spot. Here's Hachimura. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. And the Lakers lead by eight. That's their third straight make off an assist. Denver calls timeout. Radish, he's checked in for the Lakers. Here they are. It's time now to look at the NBA's top shooting teams from a season ago. The Nuggets number one. They were remarkable in terms of their efficiency on the offensive side of the ball. I mean, they did a great job of finding the open man and working for great looks. Really just an unselfish group. Holiday, the pass to Naji. He kicks to Jackson. And Davis sends it back. And there's the drive. Here's LeBron. The offensive rebound. That's tipped. And that's out of bounds. The Lakers will retain possession. Lakers ball. Hayes is checked in for James. Jackson Hayes. One fifty-one left to play here in the first. That one drops for him. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Jackson against Russell. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Davis. That's his first foul. Los Angeles making a switch here. Dinwiddie's checked in. Coming into the floor here. Here's Jackson. After Najee. Outside Jackson. Shakes off the strong D and gets to the bucket for two. And with the defender draped all over him, Jackson has that strength to fight through the contact. And the wide open shot from Reddish. No good from outside. The Nuggets trail by eight. Holiday looking over the floor. Dinwiddie with the rebound. Here's Los Angeles now. Loads it up for Davis. A flawless finish on the alley. -oop. And they have owned the paint so far. And the score reflects it. It also allows them to play inside out, which will make them even more difficult to defend. And wait to finish and cut into that lead a little bit. Yeah, but look at the, ba the basket, guys. Still shaking. Outside, Russell. The shot, no good. Gordon with the defensive effort. And on the glass so far, it hadn't even been close. Five-second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Right side, Jackson. Lock at six. Always going up for the alley-oop here. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. That's the efficiency you want to see from Jackson. Using his poise and vision to make a play. Here's Russell with the three. And so it's Los Angeles with a six-point lead at the end of the quarter. They're feeling very confident, shooting the ball with great efficiency and dictating the pace. And we'll be back with you shortly. special Noche Latina broadcast as the second quarter getting going right now and let's quickly break down the game we've seen from the Lakers here so far guys I impressive start they came in with a well-conceived game plan and have executed well let's see if they're able to keep it up so far their shot selection and ball movement has been on point they've got Torian Prince Hachimura out there with Jackson Hayes 
Then it's Cameron Reddish. And it's Dinwiddie and at the point guard position. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. And the confidence Hachimura has in himself knows he can score from this area when given the chance. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. Now, Jamal Murray had to be patient working his way back to peak form after his ACL injury. Luckily for him, hard work is nothing new. He says, I feel like I got better in the time I was out. I don't overthink when it comes to basketball. If you want to let me shoot, let me shoot. I'm just confident in my game like that. Kevin, back to you. Yeah, very confident, right, D.A.? Thank you. Then when his shot is off. Defense kind of rolled the dice there, and I'm a little surprised that it ended up going their way with the miss. Here's Jackson. Oh, oh look out! Look out! Oh, John, that's how you finish. You know Jackson can just fly. I mean, that athleticism and energy is off the charts. Now, here's Reddish, guarded by Holiday. A shot by Reddish, no good. And it's Porter with the ball for the Denver Nuggets. Trailing by four. Next matchup, they'll be home against the Suns. And that game will kick off a four-game homestand. You know, Richard, this is not just your job. You're a huge fan of basketball. So that being said, who is your favorite player to watch? Back in the day, it was David Robinson. He was my very, very first favorite player. And I actually got to play against him in his last game that he ever played in the NBA Finals when they beat us. But right now, it's probably Steph Curry, Jokic, LeBron. I, I love guys that just play the game in such a beautiful, unique way as a fan. That's my favorite. Lakers leading by four. Jokic grabs the miss. Ooh, might rush that one a little bit. Pretty clean look inside. Outside Jackson. Back to Jokic. From past the arc. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. They've led by as much as 10. Dinwiddie attacking. Makes it off the glass. Dinwiddie's got his first bucket of the night. If the defense lets him inside, he will not hesitate. He'll gladly drop that thing right in the cup. Jokic finds Porter. That's in. Coming off the assist from Jokic. The assist from? Jokic has got three assists tonight. I don't know what's happening defensively, but they're not putting up any resistance. Dinwiddie passes to Reddish. Holiday with the block. The drive by Jackson and the dunk by Jackson. And with a quick first step, Jackson remains a threat to drive on any defender. Then with it, surveying the floor, kicks to Prince. Unloads. And he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. And the Lakers lead by four. Outside Jackson. And there's the pass to Jokic. Over Hayes. Jokic gets it done right in front. In close. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. So the Lakers call timeout in Los Angeles with some changes. LeBron comes in for Prince. And it's Austin Reeves in for Cameron Reddish. Christian Brown's checked in for the Nuggets. Jamal Murray comes in for Jackson. Back to Dinwiddie. For Murray. And off the left side of the rim. And it circles in for him. Dinwiddie's got four this quarter. Here's Murray, and it's Murray with the jam. And there's an aggression to Murray's game, willing to battle there for the bucket. LeBron kicks to Dinwiddie. Passes it to Hachimura. Hayes dishes to LeBron. And he lobs it up toward the rim, and Hayes throws it down. 
Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I yeah, yeah. pass by LeBron. He reads oh, the floor okay. and gets it to the open shooter. Murray, the pass to Jokic. The big man Jokic inside. Oh, they own the interior right now. Ten straight points coming from inside. Murray against Dinwiddie. And he makes that one. Dinwiddie's got six. That scoreless first quarter, that might have woke him up, and he's turned it on here in the second. Murray against Dinwiddie. And this system thrives on Murray's aggression. When he attacks, you can just feel the energy. And when he lays back, the offense becomes stagnant. The Nuggets shooting their first free throws tonight. The first trip to the stripe in this one. They throw good Murray. And the Lakers with some changes. Anthony Davis, he's checked in for Hayes. And it's Russell in for Dinwiddie. And, and so Murray nails both of them. Probably as close to a sure thing as you can have at the free throw line. It's Davis on the win. Back to Russell. Over Murray. And it's Russell missing. The Nuggets have gone 8 of 10 from the field here in the second quarter. You've got to like how they've shot the ball. And the athleticism Gordon has poses so many problems. Looking at his numbers, just really not one of his strengths. Shooting in the low 60s last season. First one falls for him. And there's no question that Gordon is a talented player. And it's clear he wants to be a star in this league. No good on the second free throw. And it's Davis with the ball for the Lakers. James in the post. He's against Gordon. And James gets it to go on the assist by Davis. A monster down low. LeBron James, the rare package of skill, size, and athleticism. Here's Jokic. Great D that time from Davis. Look, the defense was locked in on him there. They know how dangerous he can be, and they guarded him perfectly. And it goes down two points. Defender plays tough, but Davis is tougher. Plays through the contact left, just with ease, just with authority. Murray kicks to Holiday. And Holiday with the slam. Hey, guys, I don't know that this is the time for that kind of flair. In a close game, the important thing is to get the two points. Here are the top distributors from last season. These guys always seem to find the open man. Jokic is third. Very few guys pass the ball better than he did. I mean, he didn't just have eyes in the back of his head. It's almost as if he had them on both sides, too. James looking it over. Out to Russell. Trying to find Davis. He's got it now. It's good. Now he's shooting six for seven. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Holiday, the pass to Jokic. He dishes it to Murray. Back to Jokic. Over Russell. From inside, count it in the Laker lead. has been cut down to just three in the basket from Jokic. And if Jokic has the position inside, forget it. Gordon against James. James gets inside and finishes. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. Pass to Jokic. He kicks to Holiday. Beyond the arc. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. Davis has got four rebounds in this game. It's good again in the next one. Seven for eight shooting night so far. They are just killing them on the interior. 
The Nuggets trail by seven. Holiday, the pass to Murray. Gordon inside. James covering. Outside for Murray. Over Russell. The jumper from the free throw line is good. Murray's got 15. And the mid-range seeming effortless for Murray. He's got a touch that makes that shot a good option for him. Hachimura down low. He's got six. And the dunk by Hachimura. There it is, guys. One of those effort plays that makes a big difference in the game. And GA, it is definitely making a difference so far today. Whoa, look out! Look out! Wow, okay, I see you. And there's no doubt Murray can fill it up. Good luck bringing him down to earth when he's on this kind of a roll. There's 48 seconds left in the first half. Shoots from 14. Hits hauled in by the Nuggets. Jokic has got five rebounds tonight. Left side, Gordon. Holiday with it. Picked up by Davis. Holiday gets the bucket. He's good enough where it takes a lot to bother him at the rim like that. Los Angeles leading by three. Pass to Hachimura. Back to Russell. Here's the three. It's hauled in by Gordon. Gordon's got rebound number five here tonight. And even though he hasn't been himself, it hasn't affected his team too much. They've still got the lead. And that one's good, Jokic. You simply can't move Jokic. He's like a statue out there and can hit any shot through contact. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Lakers lead by one. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks a lot, guys. With Mike Malone, as the second half approaches, Coach, what are you looking for? Execution, pace and purpose with everything that we do, uh, and making sure that when we call a set, we know what we're trying to accomplish and get the ball to where our players can be effective. We'll see if they can fix that in the second half. Thanks, Coach. Back to you. Thanks for the great interview, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of basketball following halftime. UK Sports Halftime Show. Ernie Johnson here with Shaq and Kenny and a favorite time of the year as we're halfway through one of the first games of this fresh NBA season. It was a big time first quarter from Anthony Davis. He had 14 points, three block shots, and two assists. What do you think, Kenny, about what we saw from the Lakers? Well, I love the way they're pushing the tempo, beating the defense down the floor, filling the lanes, finishing with authority early, getting to the rim, and finishing hard. And big fella, let's get your thoughts on the comments. Well, their bench production has been a major factor. Guys have been ready to go when their numbers go. It makes the second half go a lot easier on the main guys when you spread the minutes around. And that's going to do it for us here. Second half of action is coming your way. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. It's been one outstanding game from Jamal Murray. Man, he's been running wild on him through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. If they don't change their approach in the second half, eh, let's just say his success will continue. We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Taking a look at the Nuggets, Murray and Brown are the guards. The small and power forwards are Porter and Gordon. And it's Jokic in at the five, roaming the paint, and stolen by Gordon. And it's Gordon finishing it off. Gordon. And we all know Gordon isn't just going to lay it up. He's going for the throwdown every time. LeBron kicks to Hachimura. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal That's screen. Great. A chance to take a look at some stats for Murray. A very nice season for him last year. Last season, he averaged 20 points a game, six assists, and four rebounds. 
Uh, to have a scorer like him consistently deliver you points makes such a big difference for a team. He's someone you can rely on to bring it on a nightly basis. When they need a basket, he's the guy they turn to. And the best scorers, like Murray, they believe every shot they take is going in, no matter how deep they are on the floor. Here's James. Oh, LeBron's just too strong inside. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher, and Coach knows it. When it ain't broke, leave it alone until someone stops him, just let him roll. It's Porter outside. LeBron grabs the miss. The Lakers trade. And Richard, when you played with LeBron in 2017, did, did you think he'd still be elite all these years later? That man has had a two-decade-long prime, Greg. I had no idea how much longer this guy's going to be able to do it. But with LeBron, it's just different. His longevity is special. Jokic passes to Brown. Back to Jokic. That's good. He's five for nine. And you got to love the big bucket in the paint in this sort of a grinded-out game. Yeah, easy call. Jamal Murray. That's his first personal foul. Lakers And that one misses. And he's good on the second. And we're just about two minutes into the second half now. Murray against Russell. Now Jokic. Ten points for him. Here's Porter. Oh, oh wow! wow. That is powerful. Oh. What an assertive drive by Porter Jr. Charging right into the defense and getting it to go. Awesome rewind, courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. And the Lakers call time here. Without question, Jamal Murray displaying his skills today. This timeout gives them a chance to strategize because... All right, a chance to look at the stats for Nikola Jokic. He's coming off an excellent season. And he was such a reliable option offensively, finishing in the top 10 in field goal percentage. And looking back at last season, his complete dominance on the boards to rank number two overall. Absolutely remarkable. Russell dishes to James. And the pass to Reeves. Driving in. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. It's going to be on Jokic. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Really unfazed. Throw his height right out the window. This is his. And so it's Murray with it. He brings it up for the Nuggets. The lead is two. Davis against Jokic. Here's Brown. Offensive rebound. Goes back up. And Davis sends it back. And now, here's Davis, the fast break opportunity. And finished off by Davis. A premier player in this league, Davis with another huge night showing why he is an NBA champion. Russell against Murray. Passes to Gordon. Back to Murray from outside the arc. That's a miss. His fifth eight made field goal. Inside, here's Hachimura. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Hachimura's got 10 points. And his ability to efficiently score, that's really helped him out in this one. Putting them ahead on the scoreboard. Outside, Porter. That's in there. Michael Murray with Porter the assist. Jr. Murray's got his fourth assist in this one. Now, here is Russell. Five points in the game. LeBron outside. Oh 
It's hauled in by the Nuggets. Gordon's got six rebounds in the game. Outside Porter. Pass to Murray. To the inside. It's stolen by Davis. And pushing it up. Here's Los Angeles from 12 feet out. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. The right thing there to stay that tight on him and, and really try to keep him out of his comfort zone. Jokic kicks to Murray. Back to Jokic. Count it. And we'll have a chance for a three-point play. That's on D'Angelo Russell. And how about absorbing the punishment and still complete the play? That's a great finish by Jokic. And let's take a moment, guys, to get your take on the scoring so far for the Nuggets. And we also got to talk about the damage they've done inside. The opposition having a hard time keeping that ball out of the paint. Free throw, good. Jokic. And if you were to assemble a first-team all-second rounder, Jokic timeout, timeout. would be a shoe in. Timeout called the Lakers. Making a change yeah, here. Lakers Watson's checked in. Damn team. With this stoppage in play, we have a chance now to show you which teams led the league in three-point percentage last year. Fourth, the Nuggets. They ran a great system last year that put a priority on creating high-quality looks from deep, and it made them the best three-point shooting team in the league. Here now is Dinwiddie. Six points for him. This one for three. Hangs home the trifecta. Dinwiddie's got the game tied up here for Los Angeles. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. you got to show some fire and keep defending. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Dinwiddie kicks to Prince. Back to Dinwiddie. Pass to Reeves. Six on the shot clock. Here's Hachimura. It's in and good for his sixth Ooh. field goal in 10 attempts. I love how under control Hachimura is. Able to push his way through the contact and score. Nice work. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Now, some people play with a chip on their shoulder, feeling they don't get enough recognition. I can tell you that's not Nikola Jokic. Nuggets coach Michael Malone said he's not going to bed at night wondering why no one's talking about it. He doesn't care. He's reading his books on horses. We're winning games, and he's happy. If he's happy, I'm happy. Kevin, I'm happy, too. You're, you've always been happy, D.A. Hey, thanks. That was good stuff. Appreciate the report. Jackson passes to Watson. That's good, and it's Jackson with the assist that time. Watson's got his second basket of the night. Murray against Dinwiddie. To the paint, got a piece of it. Here's Jackson, and Jackson throws it down. And defense just can't keep up with Jackson. His quickness is what ensures the success of that fast break. Dinwiddie passes to Prince. It's hauled in by Michael Porter. The Nuggets leading by three. A strong finish Michael under heavy Porter pressure Jr. all over. Porter's got nine points now in just the second half. Dinwiddie against Murray. Dinwiddie kicks to Prince. Back to Dinwiddie. And a wide open look for Hachimura. Buries the long range jumper. Hachimura's got seven points here in this quarter. And 
so it's Jackson who brings it up for the Nuggets. A two-point game. Denver calls timeout. He's checked in for Los Angeles. Justin Holliday's checked in for the Nuggets. Enjoy. On the wing, Holiday. Can't connect from short range. Los Angeles has gone 2 of 2 from long range in the third quarter so far. Reddish with the ball. Still without a basket. And it's Davis with the jam. As strong an offensive presence as you'll find, AD presents more problems than his opponent has answers to. Back to Holiday. He hits Watson atop the key. And Davis sends it back. Now here is Hetchumer. Defense is right there over Watson. And there's another one for the Lakers. And a closer look here at the hustle stats for the Lakers. They've been just suffocating on defense the whole game. Look at their shot blocking. The opposition doesn't have any room to breathe. And also, guys, they've been showing how dangerous they are in the open floor. When they see a chance to get easy points, boy, they just jump in. Here's Dinwiddie. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. A great competitive game so far. And from the look of it. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter. Murray, the pass to Porter. Here's Watson, the pass to Holiday. Offline with his three. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Count that one. This team really feeds off of one another in terms of their energy. Yeah, the second half in stark contrast with the first. Coach must have gotten on them a little bit at halftime. Here's Najee. Again with the block. A, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six block. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. The shot by Holiday, no good. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. Dinwiddie outside. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. Shots continuing to fall as we conclude the third quarter. Both teams putting up points. Lakers on top, up five. And time for the short break and stay right where you are. The fourth quarter is coming up next. A moment to uh, reveal our State Farm assist of the game. And definitely deserving of the prize tonight. How about the read he made here? Looking like a point guard putting the pass right on the money. He'll be proud of that one. Bigs love when their passing skills are noticed. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. We've got D'Angelo Russell. Davis is out there with Rui Hachimura. And it's uh, Torian Prince. And it's Reddish in at the two. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Russell against Murray. Loads it up for Davis. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Here's Holiday, And it's slammed in by Holiday. Gotta take care of the ball. They'll punish you uh -huh. if you're that careless. That's right. And that's severe punishment right there. Important two points, not just on the scoreboard, but also for a little bit of momentum. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Passes it to Holiday. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. Now here is Hetchimura, guarded closer. Here's Davis. 
and that one's in. He's only missed three of 13. Look at how competitive Davis gets on the glass. He just knows how valuable those second chance shots are. Russell against Murray. Pass to Jokic from downtown. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Murray's got assist number eight here in this one already. The Lakers in the lead. Pass to Davis. Back to Hachimura. Shot clock at five. And it's sent back by Jokic. Here's Holiday. Draws contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. That's his first. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Yeah, it's clear why they go to him in these moments. They know he's going to deliver for him. James checked in for the Lakers. Austin Reed. Free throw, good, Holiday. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. For Los Angeles, they've gone two of four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. Davis finds Russell. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. No good from LeBron. Okay, they came close there to tying it up. You love the intensity out there right now. Close game, both teams leaving it all out there. Oh, a fantastic passer at his position. Gordon stays alert and ready to pass to an open teammate. LeBron, that's a two-pointer, and right through it goes. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. And his team needs every bit of his production if they want to pull this one out. It is neck and neck here in the final period. Murray gets to Holland. And James picks up the foul. That'll be his second foul of the game. That's his second personal foul. Second team foul. Gordon dishes to Holiday. There's the pass to Jokic. Things getting physical, but Jokic hammers it out and wins. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. Passes it to Reeves. Back to LeBron. Russell looking around. Shot clock at six. The shot from the low post is good. Never losing focus. Even after contact, Russell sends it home. Murray against Russell. Pass to Holiday. Back to Murray. Launches it. Here's Jokic. Jokic always hovering. Oh, great effort. They're fighting for that loose ball. Joker continues to attack the offensive glass. From deep, James sinks the three-pointer. LeBron's got five points in the quarter. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the deep. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now, Jokic, pass to Holiday. And Davis sends it back. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Just lost his head out there. It'll happen if you're pushing a little too hard. Los Angeles has gone 3-7 tonight from three-point territory. Here's LeBron to take the lead, and Davis lays it in. Davis has got 22 points. I respect the defender's enthusiasm, but Davis is too skilled for that to stop Bishop. Now here's Murray. Here's Jokic. There's another block, and that's nine blocks. You know he's going to be coming hard for that 10th, too. 
Murray finds Jokic. Jokic takes the contact and scores. He's unguardable. Nobody been able to contain him here in the fourth quarter. Now four of five from the field. James against Gordon. James good. LeBron's got nine points here in the second half. And ladies and gentlemen, if you were wondering what it's like playing against LeBron, it is not fun. He's too big, he's too strong, and just gets the contact and the finish. Murray kicks to Holiday. Over to the left wing. From deep, Jokic. Yes, Never and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Green. Holiday's got four assists now tonight. He lobs it up, and Reddish with the swing. And how about the incredible timing on that alley-oop? He absolutely hammered it down. Denver calls timeout. Every timeout, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. I'm sure all of the above is in order, and you can and now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Nikola Jokic. And guys, he's been about as close to perfection as you can be. The intensity he's played with has been amazing. Just no let up. And as fired up as he's been, he's never let his emotions get out of control. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. Well, I got a chance to hear what the Nuggets head coach was saying to his team. Now, they preached the little things in the huddle. They asked their team to battle on those 50-50 balls. One extra possession could be all the difference. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you, David. Outside Holiday. Wide open look here for Murray. Knocks down the three ball. Oh, Murray. Murray's got 26 points. Things are heating up for him behind the arc. He only had one three in the first half, but now he's up to three in the second. Kicks it out to James. Now the pass to Hachimura. Lakers working the ball around now. No one covered. Reeves has got it all tied up now for the Lakers. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. This is today's NBA. Hey, we see this kind of exchange more often than not. Murray, the pass to Holiday. From 11 feet away, passes it to Murray. From deep, and the call up against Jokic. That'll be his second foul of the game. And again, Denver with the triple. The defense a step slow, Jamal and you can Murray. see the results. Christian Brown's checked in for Justin Holiday. Wrong. Lakers trail by three. Outside, Russell. The dish to Davis. Reeves the pass to James. From deep three-point land. James showing the range. And he just seems to always deliver in the clutch. And, and he's got it going right now. That's who they want taking the big shot. Brown the pass to Gordon. Here's Brown. Back to Gordon. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. He is all oh, gas and no break. James caps off a beautiful fast break. Pass to Jokic. It counts. And the foul. That one on Davis. Huge. Jokic comes through just fearless. What an option. One shot. Free throw, good. Jokic. See, it's easy to see why his teammates trust him. He's a leader on this team and loves coming up huge in the clutch. Here's LeBron. Rebound by the Nuggets. Well, they'll be happy with that look, even though it didn't fall. Tough to watch those miss. I'm sure they'll convert the next chance. 
Oh. Boy, they needed that one. And, and Gordon delivers. His productive habits really paying off there. Here's LeBron. LeBron powering inside. Oh, my gosh. LeBron James is hitting a huge bucket. No one has done it more for longer than LeBron James. To the middle. Here's Jokic. It's good. Jokic just got 30 points. Calm and collected in the game's biggest moments. You can rely on Jokic when you need a basket. And it's slammed in by Davis. And that's what you call a big-time shot by a big-time player. AD demonstrating just how clutch he really is. Pass to Jokic. Fades back. Good! Well, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. Here's James. Oh, oh yes! yes. This is who LeBron James is, an incredible leader. When the game is tight, this guy willing to step up. Here's Murray. He gets hauled in by Los Angeles. Game could be on the line right here. It's now or never. Quarter against Hitchumer. LeBron passes to Davis, and it's sent back by Jokic. It drops. Time call here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. They're down by one. 17 seconds left to play here in the fourth. What do you think, guys? We're all 17 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Murray against Russell. Down low, deflects the pass. It's stolen by Davis. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those so they can get him in the penalty. Yeah, you have to do that, though. You can't just let him do the game. Los Angeles calls timeout. And so they foul intentionally. Michael Porter Jr. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Good on the first, and that will put them up by two. So he goes two for two at the one. It's a three-point game. The last make was huge. Now, realistically, the worst-case scenario for them is OT. Denver calls timeout. D2 for Murray. And so it's the Lakers who come out on top here. What a show they put on here at home tonight. I mean, these are those games that feel so great to win. And, and really, it's like a knife in the gut to lose. Uh, you you got to love being on edge of your seat. And just wondering what's going to happen. How is this thing going to play out? It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, LeBron. Tough win. What was the focus offensively? Just trying to make plays. Just trying to make plays throughout the whole game, especially in the fourth. Uh, we were a little lethargic to start the fourth. They made a run, but when I came in, it's, it's, it's my job to go out and make plays for our team. And they fed off of it, man. That's a win. Back to you. Thank you, David. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. This is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching.